Hi everybody, Meredith here again today. I hope you've had a great start to the holiday season. I personally have. I've been decorating my home and um, watching a lot of Hallmark movies and Christmas movies and just enjoying everything that you can from the comforts of your own home. And so super excited. I've actually been gift wrapping and I, you can see in the pic, there's some ribbon hanging down. I used some ribbon there and um, forgot to put it back up, but oh well, this is a casual video. So this um, video is going to show you how I decorated my home this year. I'm still working on getting things for this home. I moved here um, last year and so this is my second Christmas here and um, this is just for memory's sake I wanted to post this and then also I like looking at how people decorate their home even if it's not my personal style. This in no way is, sh is showing like thinking I'm great so please don't say anything mean in the comments but um this is just a video showing like this is my personal taste and this is what I love and kind of walking through that. So we're going to head right to the decorations. And again, um, just so you know, this is not all areas that I have decorations, decorations and like my bedroom and things like that, but I'm just showing you the main areas. So we're going to go in and start watching that. Here is my new Christmas tree. It's new to me this year. Super excited about that. You can see my green chair with my um, pillow that is from Target last year or the year before. And I love it. This Christmas tree is so tall. Um, it fits the house so much better than my small one, which I moved upstairs. Um, there is a nativity down below. That was a gift from my parents. Um, and then I'm scanning the tree so you can see kind of a close up of some of the ornaments. Um, I didn't put all my ornaments out this year, um, trying to keep it a little more simple. And I have some ornaments up on the upstairs um, tree as well. My parents have always given us an ornament for every year, I guess, that we've been alive. So, so from birth. Um, and then we get a special one each year. And then ones I've collected over the years as well. Here is a close-up of some of my favorites. That one is an M from Anthropology. Christmas tree that was from Germany my parents brought back. Um, that sphere that is rose gold is from West Elm, an angel from Germany again for my parents' trip. Um, lots of fun ones. I just, I love pulling them out every year and seeing, um, and bringing back memories that I've had. This is a Russian doll from, um, Anthropology, and it's also a puzzle, which I think is pretty cool. Here is my kitchen table and you can see some star on the wall and a star in the window. And you can see the candelabra on the table. Again, I had that out at Halloween time and I have it out for Christmas time. It's a great holiday season item. And then these are some puzzles that I pulled out as well. I always do my puzzles on this table. So I'm getting ready to do that. I wanted to film this video before I start pulling it all out. And I will link these down below. They're great quality pillow, um, puzzles and I highly recommend them. Those little trees on the table were a gift from my sister this year and I absolutely love them when we went shopping to a local store. Here is one of my Willow Tree Nativities with a Bath and Body Works candle. I love Bath and Body Works candles this time of year and I think it looks really nice with the lighting on the Willow Tree Nativity. Here are some candy dishes. These are from Pottery Barn. And my sister had them last year and they made me laugh. Like they're just so funny looking. So I had to get them and obviously fill them with treats, a reason to eat candy at this time of year. And my Lego wreath that I did build from my November favorites and it, I absolutely love it. And my advent calendar, I always do an advent calendar and um, since I was a small child. And here's some Jingle Bell garland from Target and a Santa sack from World Market. World Market is a great place to find Christmas decor at a decent price. Most of the stuff up here is from World Market. Um, the scarf that Prancer's wearing is from Lush, however, and those lanterns are from World Market. One was a gift from a friend and one I had purchased myself. And I really like how it came together. This is a wreath that is great for after Christmas even. It's a winter wreath and it's from Anthropology, and it's felted. Here's an overview of the living room. I just love how it all came together. It feels very festive and fun, and I like those spots of bright color in my home. 
Here is the sofa with some holiday pillows. Those are from um, World Market as well. And you can see the TV, which I always put on <laughs> a fireplace thing on YouTube. It's so fun to watch. I highly recommend them if you haven't used them. It's just like that old Yule Log um, video that used to play on TV. And then Santa and some and furry friend animals, a couple nativities down below and a little house. Um, I just love all sorts of things that I can find along the way and I find homes for it. And this is another nativity. This is actually made in Israel and I love it. Here is my laser cut village trees and animals. This is from Crate and Barrel. They've done it a few years. I don't know if they did it this year. And then I used some doilies that my great grandmother had made and I'm happy to be able to use them. Here is my last willow tree nativity. This is the big one with all the pieces. I love pulling this out. It's a great remembrance for the season and why we celebrate. Okay, I hope you enjoyed. Last but not least, I made a TikTok. I don't really make TikToks, but I saw this TikTok and I thought it was really fun. So I'm gonna add that to the end of this video. I hope it comes out okay and that you can kind of understand what's going on in it. It's basically me changing from fall decorations to Christmas decorations. So to end the video, we're gonna watch that. Okay, that was it. I hope you liked um, watching the video. I would love to see pictures of your decorations and things like that. Um, places that you love to shop, please leave comments down below. And let me know. Um, I'm always looking for new stuff and looking to change things up a little bit. And I'd love to hear. So I hope that you all have a great day and I will see you next week with my new video. Bye.